Hi everybody, this is Fagun Shah from Integration Lab. Uh, Integration Lab is basically a channel where I post automation videos using Public Connect and sometimes some other tools as well. In today's video, we are going to see how you can create your own custom personal avatar using a tool called FAL AI, F -A -L dot AI and how you can use that personal avatar inside Public Connect automation right so let me first show you how uh, what exactly we are trying to achieve okay so for example uh, i have found this uh, free uh, photo shoot of this person itai verchik uh, on unsplash now let's say uh, i want to train a image generation model using file ai on this particular person so what do i mean by that so currently this person is standing in this many po uh, poses right but i want to use the same person uh, in different situation let's say he is a superman or maybe let's say he is uh, standing in front of a sports car or he is doing a public speaking all those kind of things okay so same way i, I use this person because i did not had any uh, good high resolution images of my own i did not had any professional photo shoot images but i wanted to do like proper video so i use this one uh, i will also give proper credits in the video description for this uh, particular collection all right so these are the images by the way uh, you can click on load more and check more images as well i downloaded 10 uh, random images out of all these images and then i trained a model uh, flux model based on uh, those 10 images and generated this kind of images okay so there is two different way to achieve this if you only want to do like for few times uh, then you can directly uh, do that by going to this particular link file ai uh, is the website where they help you generate text to image and image to image image to video text to video all those kind of uh, inputs and outputs right so yeah this is for first you need to train a model to train the model they recommend that you at least upload 10 images for good results if you want even better result go for more than 10 images as well okay now i have already done that you can see that i have uh, trained it multiple times uh, here you can see john uh, then this one was failed actually and then there was victor as well right so i use the same uh, person to train this model twice okay now it is very easy to do like you enter the trigger phase now this is the uh, trigger phase which you need to use in, later on to actually generate the image how so for example i want to use that uh, person to become a superman then i need to mention that trigger phrase in my prompt in this particular model okay so yeah that is how the whole thing will be set up you can uh, select the training style as like a subject or a style as well the more uh, steps you select the cost will be little bit higher the training is super fast done within most of the time within one minute if you choose 1000 steps if you go for more than 1000 step it might take two three minutes as well i re i would recommend go for at least 2000 steps okay the cost will be around like four to five dollars but it is worth it okay that's what i have most of the time used uh, to go for higher number for the step and i get better result out of it as well right so yeah this is a way to do via uh, dashboard okay now once this is uh, done you will get something output like this okay then you have an option to click here called the button called run interface if you click on that it will take you to your custom trained model for that thing okay and you can see the path is already added scale is already set up and you can here just type john as a batman i guess uh, let's try to run it right i have already trained it so remember we have trained that model on this particular person so his face should be very matching to that guy okay but yeah batman uh, has a mask but you can see as a public speaker maybe right uh, that should give a face without a mask i guess so let's check that 
you see it is very very matching uh, and yeah very high resolution as well and everything is very good right so yeah this is the purpose but we want to do this via public connect in case you want to do this via public connect uh, i from what i have seen till now people choose to like train the model via file ai and then they try to use that trained model inside uh, basically like a public connect uh, workflow so let me show you what i mean by the way if you want to get this particular custom app you can go to my store store.integrationlab.in and then you can go to this particular product okay file ai turbo flux trainer mm -hmm. and everything i am showing right now in video is included inside this particular custom app if you want to use it in public connect and yeah you just need to do add to cart make the payment and it will deliver to your public connect email address make sure you use the same email address as your public connect account email address to make the purchase mm -hmm. and yeah you can then access this app just like i am showing in my uh, video right now okay mm -hmm. so here is the first action that you need to use in case you want to train the model via public connect uh, you need to give your image data url in a zip file url basically okay you mention you need to mention your trigger phrase you mean need to mention your steps currently it is here thousand default is thousand as well and in case you want to do the uh, want to get the webook uh, request status via webook you can enter the webook url as well okay uh, if you want to train it on a subject face or something i would recommend go for training style as a subject not as a style right and uh, if you for you if only the face is important go for face crop as a true as well okay by the way i have also given the link for that particular model in the description sorry in the important note as well in case you want to try the same thing via dashboard as well right so once that thing is done you will be getting something like you need to by the way use this action get response by response url and you will be getting uh, you need to pass the request url from a response url in the here and that will basically give you lora weights for it okay and you need to use this lora weights into next action where you actually generate the images via prompts okay so here you can see i have added the prompt john on the stage with mike sitting uh, on the chair uh, square hd uh, and i have mapped this thing from here now you don't need to keep these two steps always in the workflow you can simply delete these two steps but make sure you basically uh, paste this particular uh, lora path from this uh, get the response uh, url uh, step right and yeah uh, then lora scale will be one that will give you the base results for now enable safety checker true false it doesn't matter unless you are generating nsfw uh, images kind of things i have also added uh, webooks you can also mention how many images you want to generate okay so yeah let's try there we go it is now in queue we have also received the response url which we are going to use in the next step here and we got the output already sorry i think so i selected something you see he is sitting on a chair with a mic in his hand and yeah so basically it is very very similar so in case you want to generate your own images uh, in different situation this is the app that you need to purchase from my store and then you also have to like uh, connect it with fal ai uh, the training will cost around uh, anywhere between 2.5 dollars to 5 dollars based on the number of steps that you choose uh, for the training and yeah then per image generation is uh, this much okay 0 0.035 dollars for uh, each image it is actually very fast uh, most of time i have seen that it generates the image between anywhere between three seconds to 17 18 seconds so yeah for one dollar you can generate like 29 dollar uh, 29 images so just imagine uh you want to like uh, do a professional photo shoot or you want to generate your different images for your maybe video thumbnails or something like that you can do this uh way as well right it is super cheap you don't need to hire a, a photographer 
for uh, again for this kind of images and it is very hard to identify as well you know that these are uh, uh, ai generated images like it looks very very real as well so yeah i hope this video helps you uh, if you haven't subscribed to my channel please do that and in case you want to support me uh, please purchase my app uh, and if you want me to set up this uh, workflow for you or if you want me to uh, train your model please feel free to send me a dm via facebook or send me an email on fagun at integration lab dot in and yeah uh, we can discuss your use case and uh, yeah we can set it up for you as well okay uh, yeah i hope this video helps you see you in the next video till then uh, take care bye bye